One of the most challenging disorders to treat in psychiatry is PTSD or post-traumatic stress disorder. Now, the reason why it's very difficult is because the medications are of minimal effect. They don't really work all that well. Patients don't feel that much better with medication alone. Now, I always recommend if you're suffering from PTSD that you get yourself a good therapist that can do trauma-based psychotherapy. It's extremely important and probably one of the main ways that I've seen patients actually get better. And there's several types. My favorite personally is cognitive processing therapy. You can look into that some more or we'll talk about it in another video. What I wanna focus on here is how can we make the medications more effective and has there been any recent data beyond just starting sertraline or peroxetine or fluoxetine for the treatment of PTSD? Well, in fact, there were three clinical trials that looked at the combination of sertraline and the atypical antipsychotic brexpiprazole. So it's a total of 550 participants in these studies and they found a substantial reduction in symptoms. In fact, 68.5% of the patients in these trials had a greater than 30% reduction in their symptoms. This translated to improvements on the CAPS-5 versus sertraline alone. There were also gains in prosocial mood and resilience for these patients. And maybe most importantly is there was no relapse through the 12 weeks that these participants were followed. So if you find yourself in a situation where sertraline or fluoxetine just isn't cutting it for PTSD, you may want to consider the addition of the atypical antipsychotic brexpiprazole. There is at least some degree of evidence supporting its use in PTSD.